happening here? <laughs> it's Monday and we've returned to the office and it is a disaster area. You gonna shoot that? Yeah. Whoa! I like this. Okay, as you may have seen yesterday, this was all our winnings from the epic claw machine battle. <laughs> so, another one to add to the donation bin. Yay! <laughs> so, Tegan kind of had a good nap today. He slept like three hours. We didn't drop him off at his grandparents' house till like three in the afternoon. We didn't get here till like 3.30. We only had time to record one new video. <laughs> but we spent the rest of the time just picking away at our mess. Mm -hmm. The mess that you saw earlier. Yeah. We haven't picked at that yet. We've been <laughs> picking at all our other messes. We, um, since we're, since we're trying to get our new house all set up, we're still in the holding pattern on that. We're starting to pack our stuff up. Because you guys know how much stuff we have. I can't, you wouldn't believe. This is, you see this stuff in the background? That's just the stuff that we have on display. We have stuff. We have a lot of stuff. It's going to take us from now until the house is done just to pack our stuff up. And then it's going to take us like three years to <laughs> unpack our stuff. We heard that Funko is discontinuing the pony vinyl figures, but which is kind of sad. But they had a really good run. We honestly can't think of too many more characters that they could add to the lineup. We are missing Luna and Celestia. We never found them. Our Hot Topic never got them. And we haven't seen them anywhere else. And in case anyone was wondering, Discord is just hiding out on a separate shelf. Yeah. And my awesome glittery Twilight is hiding way up on this top shelf. Like a place of honor, way up there. But as you can see, we have tons of stuff to pack up. I'm snups. I'm snupsing. You're snupsing? I'm snupsing. I, I need to pack up my pops. And you guys know that I can never remember what I have. Pops and monster highs. You can never remember <laughs> what you have. And I don't, and you know, I don't keep them in the boxes. So to pack them up is going to be, I have to be creative because I don't want the color you can't just pack them up like this and throw them into a box because the paint transfers. We've learned that the hard way. I think I have a, I have a, uh, someone. <laughs> Who do I have? One of these guys, their paint has transferred, so they have like a mark on their head somewhere. Final Masians also do that. I don't remember which one it is. Oh, I think it's actually a doctor. Ah, right here. See? Paint transferred and he has a smudge now. Are you sure that's from that or like tumbling, taking a tumble and landing <laughs> on the floor? No, that it's from a paint smudge. And another thing about storage stuff, we've learned this the hard way. Even if you don't play with them, you know, even right out of the package and then put them laying down in like a tote or something, Equestria girl hair will get like crazy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, even if it's just in storage. Yeah, it's like like our Octavia's hair is a mess, and all it was was in storage. And in storage, it was laying in a tote. It wasn't. Yeah. Like they were all. I don't know. None of them are terribly bad right now because Ben fixed a bunch of them. Yeah. But like some of them with like the. See it a little bit here, like it gets misshapen or just all crazy. I mean, these have all been standing up a while, so been said time to fix them up or that it settled down a little bit, I guess. Mm. I've done a lot of work with their hair. Ah! Look at, look at my paper bag! Defect. We're trying to think of something to do with Equestria Girls for like a skit, like a Canterlot High kind of skit. And we have a really funny idea. 
We want to use, we want to find a spare Twilight, you know, one of the million variations we have, and customize it so it's like the Equestria Girl version of Creepy Twilight. We want to get like some googly eyes at like the craft section. <laughs> <laughs> because Ben and I were joking, or we were talking earlier, it's like, gosh, if we do anything with Equestria Girls, Ben's gonna have to do, like, all the voices, mm -hmm. except me. And you guys know how I do with voices. It's like, I, I'd probably be Flash uh, Sentry, and we have an idea for how to involve Shining Armor, even though there's not technically a Shining Armor Equestria Girl doll. And then Ben came up with the creepy Twilight idea, which I thought was so funny. <laughs> I want to see what a a customized uh, Twilight, or normal Twilight Equestria Girl with like crazy googly eyes looks like. Oh my goodness. I'm going to high school, Ben. Oh, great. Have fun. And that would really confuse uh, Flash Sentry because he'd be, be like, another Twilight? Sorry about getting cut off mid-sentence, but the battery died during my Equestria Girl skit thing. <laughs> and now I don't remember what I was talking about. But look how much progress Ben has made. I'm getting there. So you remember my little rant about the Funko Ponies earlier? At the same time I was recording myself for the vlog, I also posted it on Instagram and people are going, why don't you just order Celestia and Luna Funkos online? And it's like, well, they're not available on the Hot Topic site anymore. And they're like $100 a piece on eBay. So that's that's a little expensive, a little more than I want to pay. Yeah, we we can't spend that much on a couple Funko figures. Especially, you know, there's there, there's still that chance, you know, that they could show up at like Target or Walmart or something. Maybe. Who knows? I'm doing the arm, the Tim Tracker arm thing. <laughs> it's a vlogger thing, I think. <laughs> Keep you moving. Do something with the yeah. other hand. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow, everybody. Bye.